Night four. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared I'm not going to be able to beat this. I'm scared I'm going to be here for a couple hours. So wish me luck. Let's do this thing. <laughs> Definitely ready. <laughs> All right. They were screwed up enough as it is! Oh no, who are you? Why are you here? And go away. Why is there two foxes? What is happening? And can someone explain to me how it could possibly be okay? Okay. You have lipstick on? What? Is that Foxy's girlfriend? Jeepers, creepers, my name. Uh oh, it's just you. Where's your, where's your girlfriend? Who's in the vent? So many questions. Oh no, that's it's done. I waited way too long. It still scares me. So much scarier than the first one. Oh, there's so much to worry about too. But now that I know what to do more, I think I can do this. I think I can picture myself doing it. Why are there two foxes also? Like, genuinely, what's the deal with that? Who is that other uh, foxy lady? <laughs> use as much flashlight. <laughs> Proceeds to use all flashlight. I'm so scared. No! You get out of the vent! Get out! Get out! Where did Balloon Boy go? He just got shoved out of the way by Nightmare Bonnie. Nightmare? I don't even know. Old. Bonnie! I have to- Oh no. It's over. It's over. No, it's fine. We're fine, right? I thought for sure it was gonna be over because we let that get all the way down. But I guess it's okay? No, it's not- Once it's over is when it starts playing the music. Then it's- Then you're done. But I think until then you're fine. Ah! That was not fast enough. She gave me false hope! Dang it, that round was going really well, too. What? What? Excuse me? What is this? What? What is this? What? Am I Freddy? I f what? I completely forgot this was a thing in this game. What is he saying? A? A? Are you burping at me? He's had a lot of pizza. I completely forgot. Am I supposed to be following this guy? I don't feel like this is probably not a good idea. What is that? What is happening? Should I be following him? 
Why is there blood everywhere? Oh my gosh. What? Hello? Okay. What is happening right now? Is that Mango? Hi Mango. How's it going? I'm inside you. It's fine. What is happening? <laughs> So that's the thing, that's the puppet, that's the thing you wind the music box up for. Because if you don't, the puppet comes and attacks you. It's in the little box in the toy room where the music box is. The puppet wants to lead Freddy back to its room. I think that's a way to like tell you who the puppet is, like introduce the puppet without phone guy doing it. I don't know, but that was, whoa, that was Spooky! I liked it! See that box right there? This box? The puppet is in there. And if you stop the music, he come out of there and he kill you. It ain't good. It ain't good, chief. Anyway, excuse me. It's just you. Oh, it's just you. I thought it was someone important. <laughs> Flashlight battery go towards these lights too. Cause if so, that's dumb. I hate you. He's got red eyes. Who put those in you? I hate it. Okay, it's 4 a.m. That's the farthest we've made it on the fourth night, which is not good considering how much flashlight we have left. Oh, big buddy, big baby, big fatty, fatty. Fatty, 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 fatty. <laughs> Is that offensive? Bonnie! I did not expect you this late. Or early? Oh no, our flashlight's dead. It's 5 a.m. though. Except it's 5 a.m. Oh no! It's 5 a.m. Come on, we're so close. How do I have any, how do I have any battery? I don't understand. I don't understand it. Oh, it's blinking. Oh, it's blinking. It be blinking. Can we do this? No, that was too, that was too late. That was too late. It wasn't too late. Oh, I'm so scared. Ah! Oh my God, it, we're so close. Yes, 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 yes! Yeah! Bring it on! I'm ready! Okay, you're back to normal. That's good to see. What? What? Please stop! Please stop, sir! Please, sir! I don't want to die. Please stop. Please go away. Why are you following me? Why are you following me? Oh, I'm so scared. Okay, um, 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 no. Hello, I'm not ready. Hello, I'm not ready. Right, I'm not ready for Freddy. Please. We need to talk about this first. Hold on. Oh, that was the puppet. Up close and personal. Right in my face. Uh, following me around because he big brain smart pants sees that I'm inside Freddy, I guess. Which doesn't make sense because in the last vision, Freddy was right there in front of my face. So I don't know who I'm in or if I'm they're like the toy. Bonnie, Chica, Freddy, and I'm in the toy Ch Freddy and the real ones are- I don't understand. But since that didn't take me long at all to beat, I might 
do some of night five and maybe try and beat night five in this episode because I thought that was going to take me a lot longer. So we might try to beat night five in this episode as well. Night five. Whew. Oh, I forgot. Phone guy was a thing. <laughs> hey. Oh, oh, hey, good job, night five. Um, hey, uh, keep a close eye on things tonight, okay? Uh, from what I understand, the building is on lockdown, and uh, no one is allowed in or out, you know, especially concerning any previous employees. Um, when we get it all sorted out, we may move into the day shift. The position just became available. Uh, we don't have a replacement for your shift yet, but we're working on it. Uh, we're gonna try to contact the original restaurant owner, I think the name of the place was Red Bear's Family Diner or something like that. It was closed for years, though. I doubt we'll be able to track anybody down. Uh, we'll just get through one more night. Uh, hang in there. Good night. That's interesting. So, since, like I said before, this is a prequel to the first game, it makes you think that the first game, like, that's the first restaurant and this is the second location. Um, which this is the second location, but the first restaurant was Fred Bear's Pizza, which is the big golden bear you'll find in, uh, FNAF 4. Hello, you. Haven't seen you yet. So much is happening. Um, oh my gosh. Ooh, buddy, hello. You're out early. You're up early, chica. <laughs> Like I was saying, uh, Fred Bear's Pizza was the original location, and that one got shut down for uh, because of the bite of '87. Was that the bite of '87? Which is all talked about in FNAF 4, which I will be playing. So it, that game will all explain it. But I just thought I'd let you know. So this game is a prequel to the first game. Which, the first game is the third location after this one. So all of the old animatronics came from Fredbear's. And were brought back to this one. These are the new models. But then they decided to go back to the old models for FNAF 1, which is the third location. It's all very confusing. And then FNAF 3 is like a completely different beast, but... I thought I'd just let you guys know that, just in case you're not on the FNAF train, which I know it's a very old franchise and everybody knows all this stuff by now, but I just, you know, just in case you don't, I thought I'd explain that a little bit. So right now we're on lockdown, I'm not allowed to leave the building, and apparently the guard that was working the day shift freaking died! So I'm gonna be his replacement and then they have to find a replacement for me, is what I've come to understand. So after night five, which is supposed to be the last night of my real shift, I'm going to be working the day shift, is what phone guy just told me. But since we're on lockdown, I'm probably gonna be here on Saturday as well, which is gonna be what night six is, I assume. The building's on lockdown because the animatronics killed the day guard, is what I'm understanding here. <laughs> Close. That was real close. I was ready for you, pal. No. Oh no. You balloon boy. I want to say some nasty words to you right now. There's no way Foxy isn't going to kill me. It's just. He's not even there anymore. Yes, he is. I've been doing that so good. Uh, he jumped out of the wall. Not even the hallway. How? What? <laughs> uh -huh. I'm crushing! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, hi. How's it going? <laughs> How are you doing this? Fine, fine, evening. Birds! Oh my gosh, that wasn't that fast enough at all. She literally made me believe that I had won. Okay, if you want to play like that, we can play like that, chica. <laughs> Can 
Can you believe that? Oh, yikes. Ah! I'm, I was dead anyway with this thing. So it didn't matter because Chica would have killed me. And even if she didn't, the marionette would. What? We're here again? What? 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 Feed the children. What about this crying one up here? I'm gonna take it to this kid. He seems very sad. Oh, I literally can't. I'm so slow. What the heck? What? What's going on? Purple guy. I literally can't move. He's crying a lot. Oh! He just died. I'm so slow. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what I'm getting here is Purple Guy. Oh my gosh, there's so much to explain. But Purple Guy was one of the founders of the FNAF franchise and he oh my gosh it's so hard to explain um there were suits that people were able to climb inside of and he climbed inside of one and it the spring locks on it broke loose and squashed him and he died and his spirit was inside the costume I believe I don't even know. It's so hard to understand. There's a bunch of more mini games that will show that and I just, I don't want to spoil it really. But there's so much lore that's so confusing. And the crying child, yipes, I don't even know. I don't even know most of the lore because there's just so much going on. But anyway, we're gonna get back to being night. Honestly, I'm glad that it's taking so long to beat this just so I can get more of those mini games because once I beat it, you know, I'm not going to get any more of those. Oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway. Oh, another one. Yes. That's a good thing about dying. Oh, I am the... The, the the thing. I am the marionette. I am the puppet master. Give gifts. Four hundred. Four hundred. Every time I gave one, it was 100 points. What do I do now? Give life? What's the fourth one going to be foxy? I've been recording for way too long, so I think I'm just gonna save this for another video. But that is crazy. Oh my gosh. That is referring to, I think, um, how there were children who d died and their souls were put inside the, their souls were in the suits and um, so giving life to the dead child by putting it inside a suit, a, f a animatronic suit, that is horrible, obviously. The story is really freaked up, but that is a brilliant way of telling you what's going on, is 
through a mini game. That is so genius of Scott Cawthon. I mean, that is just awful. <laughs> I just completely forgot about all of this kind of stuff in this franchise that we were going to be exploring, but okay, I've been literally recording for an hour, so I think I'm going to save Night 5 for its own video, even though I played a lot of it in this one, um, but it was worth it to get those mini games, because we got like three mini games from just Night 5, that's, I, I didn't even know there was going to be mini games in this one, I thought the mini games didn't start until FNAF 3. So, uh, that was so, like, so much stuff. I know. But thank you so much for watching it. The video, I mean. And if you were obviously going to do more, because I, I know I can beat Night 5. I just need some time. And I think I can do 6, too. Um, because I know what I need to do now, and I know how to do it. I just got to do it. And, uh, it'll just take a couple times, a couple tries. Um, and so that's that. But, um, the next video coming out, I believe, I actually don't have planned, so it's a surprise for us both. But, um, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a like, and more for now shortly. I will see you next time. Bye!